Glenn Sutton was taking it easy this morning, enjoying some well-earned rest after his latest race. That race was the Badwater 135 event in California, where he ran 217 kilometres in temperatures up to the mid-40s. And it was those conditions that nearly got the better of him. So I was getting a sore leg during the race about halfway through and um, at least one stage um, I, was, I thought that uh, perhaps I wasn't going to finish. But I think it's just a matter of um, just keep pushing on one foot in front of the other and, and just, uh, just keep moving forward really. Sutton finished 34th out of 97 starters, completing the race in 36 and a half hours. He says the hardest part was towards the end of the race, where he could only manage to walk, and it was his support team that got him through to the finish line. Yeah, if it, if it wasn't for them, it's, it would just be so much more difficult and, and perhaps impossible to do, so um, totally reliant on your support crew there, They're very important. His support team helped Sutton finish the race the same way as when he started. However, he did pick up a left leg injury. The injury means he has not run since the event, but it won't be long before he is back on the streets doing what he does best. Yes, looking forward to uh, putting on the running shoes again and going out for a bit of a run once this leg's come right. Um, yeah, just, just what I do. Sutton says he wants to try and compete in a 100-mile race in Napier in four weeks' time, as well as the Dunedin Marathon. And a return to Death Valley for another crack could also be in the works. I'd love to go back. Um, you know, it's, it's very, 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 very tough, but you know, I like that sort of stuff. And after a pretty impressive first crack, <laughs> there will be few that could doubt the man finishing towards the front of the pack if he yeah. does decide to return. John McKenzie, 39, Denine News.